Hey guys, and welcome to the first episode of my Caribbean foods recipes. And yeah, today I'm going to show you how to make this delicious drink called Cyril. And I'm Cyril, you know, I'm coming from Jamaica, so I Cyril it called. So let's get into it. All right, first things first, I'm going to wash up my ginger because I'm not going to peel it. I'm just going to slice it down the middle and add it to my mixture. So I'm going to go down in here with some baking soda. Y'all already know the baking soda vinegar hack. You know, y'all are not new to this, but this is actually how I clean it overall in general, whether I'm peeling it or not. It'd be a lot of dirt on the uh, ginger, so I make sure I get it nice and clean. Um, so you add the vinegar over top, it bubbles up. Once the bubble stops, then I add some cool water, and then I just let it sit there for a couple minutes until I go prep something else or something or whatever, and all that dirt comes off and you're good to go um some people peel their ginger you well, know eh, it doesn't matter we're gonna strain all of this out so this is the water this is how it looks after i remove it and rinse it from the vinegar bacon so this situation so now i'm gonna show you guys my sorrow this is how i bought it y'all already know where i live at so if you live in the islands don't come over here bothering me you know where i live at okay i'm using what's available to me so this is dry <laughs> dry sorrel and um so i'm gonna put it down in my bowl and give it a quick rinse and i just wanted to show y'all what this looks like you don't want to soak it you don't want anything you don't want to wash it more than twice because you know the more you rinse it it's the more you're going to rinse away that color and flavor so you know obviously so i gave it like a quick rinse and that was it all right so i'm going to be using my dutch oven because i don't have those big giant pots the ones i'm supposed to have honey so we're working with what we got this is the ginger that i washed up as well as three whole cinnamon sticks i'm gonna add it right down into the water um obviously this is gonna be super concentrated because i don't have a big enough pot to have the amount of water needed here and so i'll show you guys as the video goes on how i fix that well not fix it but it depends on you how strong or concentrated you want your drink you know it's it's no it's apples and oranges it's no big deal but yeah pretty much that's what i'm doing here so i'm gonna add my dry sorrel right down in here and as you can see i had to babysit it because my pot was too small but it's like again you know i'm gonna show you guys what i do <laughs> and fix it later on but look how concentrated it looks already and it didn't even sit yet or start boiling yet watch cyril cyril and amisha oh look past cyril mm. All right, so I'm just going to keep babysitting it just so it won't float over or boil over on my stove. Like I said, if you have a giant pot, you're good to go. You don't even got to worry about that. Put it on there, set it, forget it, and you go. But again, I just love the beautiful color. It's so pretty. About 12 hours later, some people do it overnight. I don't see it necessary, especially in my case, honey. <laughs> um, I had a lot, but yeah, about 12 hours. You know, I started this in the morning and it's like the end of the day now going into the night and I'm just now getting to get to it and get it done. So what you're going to do is you want to remove the, the sorrel pieces, the ginger pieces, the cinnamon, remove all of that out with a slotted spoon. Uh, don't get rid of all that stuff over there because you do need to strain that as well. Don't waste it. Um, and then after I remove it, we're going to get into the tea, honey, okay? The smell of your house is going to just be amazing, okay? Look at this piece of ginger. Look how concentrated. I told y'all, it is so concentrated, and it smells amazing, but we're going to fix that. So now I'm going to strain out the sour through a strainer into this giant bowl. Now that I have, honey, I have a giant bowl. If there's anything I got, it's bowls, okay? But I ain't got giant <laughs> pots, so I'm going to strain that out. Next, I'm going to strain it out into my pitcher. Now, if you notice here, I'm going to fill, fill the pitcher up halfway because I'm going to fill it up the, the other half with water. Because, again, it's super concentrated, right? So, here we go with the pitcher, y'all. I wish y'all could smell. The ginger was just coming all the way through, honey. I put a lot of ginger in here. And the uh, cinnamon sticks. And now you want to sweeten this up with some sugar. You don't need any lemons and limes. Um, Cyril is very uh, tart and a tad like a little smidget bitter not bitter bitter I don't know how to explain it well yeah I do but a smidget bitter but like super tart you don't need any lemons or limes so I added the sugar got it nice and mixed up and that's pretty much the drink but honey when I tell you it's worth the labor 
it is worth the label, honey. I actually haven't had this drink in so many years. <laughs> I don't think I've had this drink since I left New Jersey. Um, probably around when the passing of my dad or something like that. But um, yeah, but it's really good. It's super refreshing. Um, you know, I'm Jamaican, so I can only speak for Jamaicans. We drink this drink a lot around the holidays, especially Christmas with the cake, the black cake, the fruit cake. Uh, I won't be making that, honey. Uh-uh, that ain't in my judge. I'm not making that cake. But <laughs> um, I, I was just happy that I was able to make this drink this holiday season, and I love it. It's really good. I'm going to put it in the refrigerator, let it chill. This did make a big old giant batch, y'all. I gave a gallon of it to my homegirl and kept a gallon for myself. So it makes a lot, and it was a one-pound bag. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you for your support. I hope you give this drink a try. And I'll catch you on my next video. Bye.